In this video with the On King, I'm gonna show you the Amboss add-on. This is one of the coolest things for medical school. I actually got to take place in testing it originally and it's come a long way. I'm excited to show you what it's like. Hey everyone, here we go. I'm gonna show you some of the coolest things that the Amboss add-on has to offer. I've been using it for a year or so now and I love it. It's really handy for medical school studying. So here's the file and first I'm gonna show you is where I got that. This is the Amboss website. Uh, in fact, if you just Google Amboss Anki add-on, you'll probably find it, but I will link this in the description of this video so you can find it. And you'll just download the add-on here. There's more information as well if you need, including how to install it, but I'm gonna walk you through the quick version of that. So you're gonna download this file. You got Anki, assuming you're on a newer version and not something that's really old. You'll just double click this file. And it's gonna pop up and say, hey, do you trust Amboss? Do you wanna do that? Yes, okay. And then it'll say it installed and you need to restart Anki. You restart, everything will start working well. You'll have this up in the right corner and you'll also get this up in the menu bar. Now it's gonna ask you to log in the first time you have it. I've already logged in. And then you've got a bunch of settings here. So I'm gonna click that and show you. Yeah, there's a highlight color and a bunch of keyboard shortcuts. I'm gonna go over that in a second, but first I'm gonna show you exactly what the add-on does. So we go into this deck here. This is just the onking overhaul deck that I've been doing for step one, step two stuff. And here's a flashcard. So you can see there's these green lines underneath and it highlights and finds terms where it has definitions within Amboss, which is super cool. And it makes it really handy to get kind of the big picture when you're like, wait a second, I forgot, you know, what's preterm or whatever. Now, uh, the thing they've added just recently is now you can go here and you can click on something and it's actually going to pull this up and that's the Amboss website but inside of Anki. How cool is that? Super handy. Previously, you'd have to actually open a web browser, which you can do from this button if you want, but this is always going to be here. And then, of course, if you click this button, it'll hide it. So you can open and hide. You can go back to home. You can do all sorts of things here. You can see your dashboard, um, different settings, all within Anki which is really nice and you can resize it if you want to make it bigger or smaller now the other thing I want to show you is if we go to the settings you can actually change those highlight colors if we go here and say for whatever reason you like orange and we save them now you see that those highlights are going to all be orange so you can customize it how you want the other thing you have is these keyboard shortcuts so if you're like me and you use a gaming controller to do your Anki flashcards, which I highly recommend, by the way. And I have a video on how to set this up. So if you haven't done this, watch the video. I'll link it in the description. It's super handy and makes it so your wrist pain doesn't hurt so bad from hitting the space bar. But there's a bunch of these keyboard shortcuts. And I've configured them for this controller. So I'm going to hit save. And we'll go here and you can see I can actually just push buttons on the controller and make things happen, which is super cool. I can go backwards, forwards. I can get out of it if I want to, or I can actually open up the sidebar. So lots of cool different things you can do all within this as you're doing your flashcards. That's the Amboss add-on for you. I really like Amboss. Uh, this, they're not paying me to do this video. I, I think they're a great company. I feel like their question bank has been super handy. And this add-on when you're doing Anki is really useful, like I said, to keep the big picture. And now they have things so that it just built right into Anki. So it's right at the touch of your fingers at the end. Hope you enjoyed this video. Thanks for learning with The On King. Be sure to subscribe to our YouTube channel here as well as follow us on Facebook, Instagram, or Patreon. That is at OnKingMed. Also feel free to reach out via email or check out our website, OnKingMed.com, for more tips and tricks.